So we get asked a lot of questions with regards to um, differentials on series vehicles and how to change the oil. So I'm just going to point out a couple of key things here on, um, on changing the oil in a series diff. So this is a standard diff on a 1972 series 3 short wheelbase. And you'll see here this square plug there. So we are now on the inside looking out to the rear of the Land Rover. This is the rear axle. You'll see there there's a square plug. That is your fill plug. You'll then see under here, there is a drain plug. Now they vary on some of them. This one is a bit like a coin slot. So there's a special tool that goes in there. Um, you can use a chisel and a pair of mole grips and hold the chisel up into place, get your mole grips and twist it around and that will do the same. But let me give you a tip. Before you undo the bottom one, make sure this top one is free and comes open because if you undo that and drain all the oil and you haven't checked that you can get this open, then you're not gonna be able to refill it and you don't wanna be driving around with a dry diff. Now, what I would say is some penetration spray on this for a couple of days beforehand, just to make sure. Give it a wire brush if you need to, to make sure you've got good access. And you, again, you need a, a, a good fitment here. You can use an open-ended spanner. What I would say is get a, a lever bar just to give you a little bit of extra um, extra leverage on the fulcrum point and just make sure you get some good traction on that because they can be quite stiff. Obviously they get a lot of uh, road gunk etc kind of congealing around the thread. So good spray, wire brush, crack that first, make sure that does actually free up and open. Drain it from the bottom and let it, let it have a good drain out. Have a look in the manual in terms of how much it holds. Um, I also put EP90 in mine. Um, to be honest, I do this probably once a year, just before the winter period. Um, salt and, and water, etc. Just make sure they're done on an annual basis. So just a quick recap. Make sure you've got a good fitment on this, first of all, and you sprayed it. Crack that. Chisel in there if you need to with a pair of mole grips. Spin that out. Remove your drain plug and let the oil drain from this point here until it's dripping. And then you know it's all come out. Put that cap back in and then refill it from here. Now what I do is I've got a, a squeezy bottle with a bit of a tube on, and it's an old oil bottle that I got from a, a shop. Um, and what I ten, tend to do is kind of come up and over the side here of the, of the rear spring, um, and obviously squeeze it in there. And uh, like I said, I can't remember off the top of my head how much it takes, but that is how you change the oil on your diff on a Series 3 vehicle. Um, it's pretty much the exact same process for the front. So again, if you've not subscribed to us at Keepers Cottage, please do so and uh, keep your eye out for any future videos that we have coming up. Um, we're going to try and go through a lot of how-to videos for the series vehicles. Um, yeah, thanks very much.